What's up beautiful people? This is Khuram from My Gets Well and hope y'all are having an amazing day. In today's video, we have the GoE Dreamview T1 TV backlight. It's a immersive LED strip light kit which takes no sweat and you will be up and running with this immersive background on your wall and it will be colorful like this as you see on the screen because I directly recorded it from my camera to just showcase how it shows the different colors on the wall because of this RGB technology. And it has the segments on the LED, so that's why it was able to show you different colors simultaneously at the same time. So now let's look into what's in there. So this is the box for the Dreamview T1, also known as the RGB TV backlight. This specific one is in 75 to 85 inch screen because now we have the bigger TVs and we have the RGB logo on it because that's what it does, creates the different segments of light on your wall. And we have inside the box a couple of things for you. First, they thank you for choosing them. And then we have the welcome note, user manual and LED strip kit. In this video, we're also gonna talk about how it compares when it talks about the simplicity of the setup and how it compares with the Philips Hue gradient sync light. And we have inside the box LED strip light, we have the camera, which is the color sensing technology enabled, couple of wipes, we have the blocks in orange color, that is what you're gonna use for the calibration. This is how the whole setup is gonna be going and um, you know, in the back of the TV. So nothing is in the front besides that camera, which is gonna be at the top mounted or maybe below mounted, depending on your TV situation. But you can see everything that comes in the box and this is how it's gonna be set up. So you have camera connected to the uh, GoE box and you have the strip light going into the box and the adopter. So everything is just staying at one place. It is just amazing and simple how you set up. So now let's look into the setup side and we're gonna talk about the pricing and what is the deal for you guys for the Prime Day. So stay tuned. All right guys, so before we get into the setup, I want to talk about the Philips Hue, which is another alternative out there with the gradient strip light with the HDMI sync box and the hub. So there are three components that makes this effect on the wall for you, which we're gonna talk about the simplicity of setup, how you can get the same effect from the GUI at a fraction of price. So this is gonna cost you $520 for 65 inch and 75 inch gonna cost you $580. As compared to the GUI, it's right now on sale for $100, but just wait right now, do not just buy it. You buy it on the Prime Day because it's gonna be going for $70 plus tax. So you're gonna be saving an additional up to 30% off. So as compared to $70 and you're looking at the $580 for 75 inch, it's a big deal. Now, this is the 77 inch TV and you can use this strip for 75 up to 85. So I'm using it from the right to left, which is the counterclockwise. You can use it for clockwise, it's up to you. It's a lot easier for me to assemble like this, being a right-hander, so I'm using it from right to left. So when it's assembled, there are these anchors, the plastic one that you can use these brackets to hold these wires for the good and neat cable management. And that orange mark right there is where the camera is gonna go. So let me show you. Uh, that's little sync box that we have for the GoBee that's gonna go in the back and the camera at the top and all the cables gonna go in that little box and that's all you have to do. So adopter is plugged in, now it's time to fire it up and get into the setup. So as you can see, I have those orange calibration pointers on the TV, you have to put them seven like that because this is gonna help that camera which is the color sense camera on the top, it is gonna make sure you know, looking at the colors in a right angle and in a proper calibrated way. So go to the Google Play Store or if you have the iPhone, go to the Apple Store, download this app and you're gonna go in the LED strip light and at the bottom you will find the H6199. That's the model number for this DreamView uh, immersive light kit. And then you're gonna go in the back, press the button on the sync box just for once and that's all. And your light is set up. And you can name it whatever you want. I'm trying to keep it simple, but once it is done, it's gonna be connected to your Wi-Fi because it's gonna get some kind of uh, firmware updates if there's any, and you're gonna do the calibration. So the camera is mounted at the top, so you're gonna select the top. If it is mounted facing up bottom, you're gonna do bottom. Mine is anti-clockwise, which is the counterclockwise. So I'm gonna select the counterclockwise because it's running from right to left and make sure that you are facing the TV from behind to figure it out. 
not from the front. So it's gonna be opposite if you're looking from the front. So mine is counterclockwise from back. And then you're gonna adjust these pointers because the camera is looking at those orange blocks that you see on the screen. This is really important because it's gonna give you the accurate colors and the proper five view it's kind of like viewfinder how you have it on the cameras so that's how it is looking at the screen and it's gonna find and measure and tweak the color and you're gonna have the better performance when it is being displayed on the wall so I'm stretching all of those points carefully and make sure that all of those points are aligned to these orange blocks on the screen all right, so it is all done the calibration is complete now it's on the video side and these are the effects you can look at it it is the miss marvel colorful you know purple pink and all of that stuff and you can see how beautifully it syncs together and it is mind-blowing and all of that we have done for the price tag of 99 dollars 99 but on the prime day you're getting it for $70 and make sure that keep in mind that when you're using this uh, GUI kit you're actually not getting just the immersive lighting. You can use it for music, you can use it for solid, um, you know, if you wanna use it for bias light. But the main purpose of this is to get the immersiveness that you want. And guys, one more good thing about the GUI is that you can display anything that is on your screen to the wall to create that immersive effect. You cannot do the same thing with the Philips Hue sync box because everything needs to be connected to the HDMI to display this effect. But in the GUI side, you can display anything that is displayed on the screen because it uses the color sense technology with that camera and camera can see anything that's on the screen and display it on the wall and create those beautiful effects for you. So make sure guys go in the link in the description and check out the GUI Prime Day sale and let me know in the comment section what do you think about it and I'll see you guys in another video. Until then, peace out.